Hello, I'm on Facts of Mars, and Paul Begala, speaking on a panel with CNN, the Cannibal News Network, is calling for a military strike on Russia. I'm not making this, you can't make this stuff up. Begala, we should debate whether we should blow up Russia. It says right on video, you can find the video. Longtime Clinton family ally Paul Begala on Wednesday evening seemingly suggested President Trump for cons should consider bombing Russia in response to Kremlin's meddling in 2016 election. Well, thank God we have uh, Trump in there because he won't do that. Speaking with CNN's Anderson Cooper, former advisor to Bill Clinton, lamented how Trump supporters don't seem to be particularly outraged about Russian Russia's meddling in American affairs. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Begala, sir. I, uh, don't usually insert myself into other people's delusional psychosis. We were an hour under attack by a hostile foreign power, he said. And should be debating how many sanctions we should place on Russia or whether we should blow up the KGB, GSU, or GRU, Russia's foreign intelligence agents. He continued, if I was Trump, I would be mad as, because it has tainted his victory. No, heck, no, it did not. But you, sir, are an insane lunatic. You ought to be locked up in a mental hospital. Let's think about this. Now, how are you gonna, how are you gonna bomb Russia? Are you gonna send in phalanx bombers to bomb their uh, headquarters? You're gonna ignite World War Three, all because these whiny, sniveling liberal Democrats are still complaining about the election results. They're still complaining. But this one is a certifiable maniac, and I don't know, he should be locked up. I mean, he's calling for war with Russia. Sorry, no way. I don't especially care to have a nuclear bomb land on my head, Mr. Uh, Begala. You, sir, are crazier than Loon. You ought to be locked up. We put Trump in there to do a job, you moron. It wasn't the Russians that put Trump in there, you moron. It was the voters, you moron. You get it? I'm on Facts Mars and I'm mad as hell. Thanks for watching.